come back. Andrea, my lifesaver. Okay. So, wow, that was super stressful. My dress broke in like three parts. They were very rough with my luggage, it seems, and a lot of my jewelry is broken. My gun broke and I had to glue that together. So t this morning has been a crafting recovery day as well as getting ready, but now I am at peace. I'm finally ready. This outfit, yeah. It is Saturday of Comic-Con Lima. I'm going to head over now. It's about 11 o'clock. Andrea Hi. is going to help me and carry my stuff because I'm a mess this morning, an absolute mess. Okay guys, it is 12.30. We just got to the convention and we are gonna go on stage so that they can announce all the guests and show us off and all that kind of stuff. So I will be passing my vlog over to Grisha. And yeah, I'm wearing my cloak because it's cold. the signage backstage area. Hey, Grisha. Hi. Grisha helped me vlog whilst I was on stage. Hey, Steve. Hey. This is Steve. Oh. He's okay. I mean, like, he's all right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Steve's the Red Power Ranger. He is awesome. And he's like super cool at martial arts. I can't even touch my toes. And he's on stage like flipping around. And it was pretty crazy. Thanks, thanks. We have a table full of food and I've eaten most of the chocolates girl. that were on it. Holly looks freaking beautiful today. Look at this girl. Girl. You are the queen. Bow down. We are going out for signing and photos soon. I'm constantly jingling, so when I go to edit this vlog, it will just be like, jingle, 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 like Christmas. Oh, God, it's this guy again. If you don't recall from Ecuador vlogs, this is like my bestest friend in the whole world. G'day, mate. G'day, mate. It's Daniel Logan. Gee whiz, how you I love your top. Thank you. What can I say? That's the, the best beach bod I've ever seen. Well, I'm, I want to look like that. So awesome, yes. Let's take pictures of this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to take pictures of this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I will wear one for you. I'll take, I'll just, oh. instead of this outfit is gross. I need that shirt in my life.
So this is my little line, and then we've got a bigger line, and we're kind of like... Hey guys, basically the tassel came off my shoe completely, so I'm lock tightening it back down and it's frayed a bit, so I'll have to fix this whole cosplay for like, oh, I reckon there's two days worth of repairs here, and it's a very busy day today. Hey guys, I forgot to tell you, having a sneaky lunch break, we have nearly like sold out of prints. It is crazy, I did not expect this, and it's only day two. Ugh. Just having some lunch now, I'm gonna find some sushi because I need sushi in my life so badly, and then I'm gonna get back out there. This cosplay! Yes. Yes, I'm so excited. <laughs> and call it a day, it is about 6.30 now, and we have been flat chat. Hey guys, so I just got out of my dress and took off all my jewelry. I'm in this tank top that someone lovingly gave me. I just wanted to show you my battle wounds. So I taped the dress to me with industrial tape, and it scars and burns, and I get blisters, and I have these marks for weeks. Cosplay is pain. It's pain. Hey team, welcome to an amazing voiceover by me. I just wanted to first start by apologizing how long it has taken for me to edit and get this vlog out to you guys. I know this convention was towards the end of July and we are now in the beginning of September, so that is just my bad. I've been so busy with uni and work, it's just been really hard to get around to this stuff. I didn't get the chance to vlog the final day of Comic-Con Lima as Suicide Squad Harley Quinn because quite honestly it was just super overwhelming. 
I spent one hour getting my tattoos on, one hour doing my makeup, and then a final two hours getting the wig on. So after four hours of getting ready and also three days of conventioning, I was just too exhausted to vlog the convention. What I have done for you guys is I've compiled all the landscape videos that were on my phone that my assistant Grisha took for me so that you can still get a snapshot of what the final day of the convention was like. As you can see in the videos, it was just insanely busy all day. I have no words for how crazy it was. It has been an entire year since I've cosplayed Suicide Squad Harley, and as you can see, I'm sporting a beautiful custom-made wig by the amazing team at Hero Hair based in New York. So you can follow them on their socials, which is Official Hero Hair. As much as I miss doing this cosplay, it was exhausting. I do not miss the sequin chafe and the high heels at all, but it was so much fun to get back into character and really enjoy being that version of Harley again because that is how I started. I'm so so grateful for the opportunity to have gone to Comic Con Lima. It was the most surreal experience. I had so much fun and met so many amazing people and that is a lot thanks to you guys. So thank you so much for all your support and for watching this video. I love you so much and see you in the next video. Bye. So, eh, Laura, your final words to your Peruvian crowd. Tus últimas palabras para tu público peruano. I love you and I miss you already. Los amo y ya los extraño. Cómico. Ole, 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 ole. Cómico. I believe in you, and that's what matters. It, it could be the worst footage in the world, but it's the thought that it counts. It was made with love, guys. It was made with love. Is it filming? <laughs> Dress and took all my cute little moi, moi, moi jewelry off. <laughs> okay, and vlog goodbye. All of that. Okay, I love you guys. And vlog goodbye. And vlog goodbye. And vlog. And vlog. Yeah. And vlog. Fun times. I don't know. Anyway, and vlog goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> and vlog.